So uh, I'm not disturbing your tea drinking too much. Uh, no, it's fine. Um, thank you. Come with us now on a journey through time and space. To the world of the mighty boosh. What was it like being part of um, the mighty boosh? Um, yeah, the, the mighty boosh, the boosh was great, and it was uh, came off the back of Noel and I having done quite a lot of stand up on the circuit in London and around England, and um, sort of doing that, doing stand up, and then we'd started working together, and I just thought. We, we liked it, we liked being on stage together, we had good chemistry very immediately and so then we just started pitching ideas to radio and TV and didn't really get anywhere for ages and so it took, we, we just did Edinburgh a lot of times after that and toured around and took the show around to work in Melbourne and, and sort of developed a bit of a following live uh, and then eventually they let us do some TV and we sort of continued the spirit of of how we'd been doing it live, basically, and tried to keep it lo-fi and have our friends in it and not be told too much how to do it. I'm very proud of it. I mean, it, it was a sort of a meeting of various sort of coincidental people and, and, and times and moments. It was before Twitter and before all that sort of stuff, before the social media thing kicked off. And so it had a whole different launch into the public consciousness, I suppose. It was very low-key initially. When we first went on tour, no one, we didn't really know what was going to happen at all. And it actually was, we suddenly realised there was a big fan base, but no one knew, least of all the you know, TV people or any of those people, who, they just, they didn't seem to equate. There was quite a lot of love for the show, basically. So. Which is still around, it's nice. My kids now watch it. It's great to be able to watch it with them, because I don't watch my own show, really. There's no reason to, it's a bit creepy. So you, with, with my kids now, I can legitimately watch it and enjoy it, you know. I quite, I quite enjoy it. Noel and I often talk about what we would do next if we were to do something, you know. Um, maybe a big baking show, I don't know. Think about it, You're just sort of running ideas up. Against uh, yeah, we, we're sort of uh, always sort of thinking maybe we'll do something, but it's like we have a, a thing we did, and it's you sometimes think maybe it's maybe that's that's what we did. Um, but well, no doubt we'll run out of money soon, and you'll see our tour. I, I can imagine he's both on the Great British Bake Off. Mm. Noel's on it. I know. You know I'm not. I'm not. It came to me first. I said, uh, I'm too busy, obviously. And, uh, but I, I gave them Noel's number and uh, there you go. So that nice tea. Uh, yeah.